In today's video, I'm sharing some lazy breakfast that I had last week. These come together in 10 minutes or less, so they're perfect for when you want something yummy but don't have a lot of time and energy in the mornings. Monday morning and I'm starting with a green smoothie but the lazy version so I got this green smoothie mix which has a bunch of greens and fruits so I'm adding some in my blender and topping with some apple juice. This is perfect for adding some greens to my diet and because it's mixed with fruits it's nice and sweet too. So I just blended it up and served on my glass to enjoy before my breakfast. Yamas. Yeah, oh that is good. I think the apple juice definitely gives it loads of sweetness so I like it. And then for my actual breakfast, I got some bagels in the house, so I'm cutting one in half to toast. Once it was toasted, I spread a thick layer of cream cheese and then topping with some thin cucumber slices because cream cheese and cucumber is just the best combination. Let me know if you agree in the comments. I've been obsessed with this breakfast recently. It's so quick and easy to make and I've been craving it pretty much every day. Tuesday and I'm starting my breakfast by boiling some eggs to make sure I get enough protein to keep me full and energized throughout the morning. So I just added some eggs to boil and while they're boiling I'm cutting up some fruit to have on the side as you know I can't start my day without fruit. And today's choice is watermelon so I'm just cutting it up in cubes and serving some in my bowl. And I love starting my mornings with fruit, especially watermelon as it's so rich in water, it's very hydrating and just makes me feel so good. And then I made a bit of avocado toast, so I cut an avocado and scooped out half of it on my chopping board. I mashed it with my fork, seasoned with salt and pepper and added some lemon juice. And since I had those bagels in the house, I couldn't resist having it again for my breakfast, so I cut one in half and toasted it. And my eggs were ready by then so I served them on my plate and I then added my toasted bagel. And for one half of the bagel I'm adding the mashed up avocado. I'm also topping with some baby tomatoes and some walnuts and if you haven't tried adding walnuts to your avocado toast trust me this will elevate your avocado toast so definitely give it a try. And for my other slice I'm doing cream cheese and cucumber of course because once I find something I like I need to have it on repeat until I'm absolutely sick of it and then move on to a different thing. Let me know if you're the same. Wednesday and today's fruit of choice is a nectarine. So I just chopped that up and enjoyed it before my breakfast as these days I get so hungry in the mornings I need to snack while I'm making my breakfast. And for my main breakfast I was actually super busy this morning and couldn't be bothered to make anything fancy and on these days I love having a few of these crisp breads and topping them with cheese, perfect for those super busy mornings. Thursday today and these summer fruits are just so good, I love the variety so today I chose cherries and they were so yummy. Let me know in the comments which one is your favorite summer fruit by the way. And for my actual breakfast I'm boiling some eggs again as I find they keep me full and they're just so yummy. I'm also grabbing some bread from my freezer and I always like to keep my bread in the freezer to make sure it doesn't go bad before I have a chance to eat it. So I just grabbed a couple of slices of this seeded bread and putting them in the toaster to toast. And for my drink I'm having some green tea as I find it helps with giving me energy without the big crash that coffee tends to give me as well. And now for my breakfast I'm serving my eggs and then my toast. I'm adding my eggs on one of the slices, cutting them in half and seasoning with salt and pepper. And for my other slice I'm doing some Greek honey as I wanted something sweet too so I just spread a bit of Greek honey on the other slice. And you can add butter to the toast as well but I was out but I also find that butter weighs me down a bit so I prefer to have it without especially in the morning. And Friday we're going back to the trusted old bagel, so I'm cutting it in half and toasting it. While it's toasting I'm chopping up a nectarine and snacking on it while I wait for my bagel to toast. And once my bagel was toasted I served it on my plate and today I'm topping it with some hummus. So I added a thick layer of hummus and then topping with some cucumber slices that I thinly sliced on my mandolin slicer. And that was breakfast, again super quick to make but very yummy and nutritious, so this kept me full throughout the morning. 
I've been obsessed with bagels, as you probably could tell by this video. I could have them every single day and I really wanted them with cream cheese today, but because I've been so obsessed, I finished it. So I only had some hummus. I'm sure it will be good, but I need to go buy some more cream cheese later. Very good. Cucumber and hummus goes so well together. I love it and I love that creamy hummus. I know it's a bit more expensive, but I just love it. It's so creamy and like nice and tasty. And I've been getting so hungry in the mornings recently that I want something quick and easy. So this came together so quickly. I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did make sure you give me a big thumbs up and if you'd like to see a full day of eating you can check out this video and I'll see you in the next one.